Ladies and gentlemen, to whom it concerns, it's The Late Late Show. And here is your host, Gay Byrne. Uh, Garabandal has now become, of course, a place of pilgrimage. Uh, it doesn't have the stature, the same stature as Lord or Fatima or, or not, but it certainly does have two extraordinary things about it. One is that, as distinct from the other places, many of the other places of, of apparitions, there is actually film available, a lot of film available, of the happenings at Garabandal, what happened during the various apparitions. I'm talking about standard stock 16 mil Kodachrome color home movie film. And the second thing which makes it unusual is the four girls to whom the apparitions happened are still alive. Three of them living in America, one in Spain. Uh, Conchita Gonzalez is one of those girls. She is now living in New York here. She's married to an Irishman called Kina, not Kena, Kina, like in Keenan without the final N. And she has four children here. And she normally does not welcome publicity and she does not give interviews to newspapers or radio or television because she wants to preserve her privacy. And, uh, but because Garabandal is much talked about in Ireland and because we featured it before, she agreed to come and talk to us on The Late Late Show and it's lovely to have you with us. Thank you for coming, Conchita Gonzalez. Now, can I start first of all by asking you, um, you, you were all about 13 years of age when the apparition started. What did the Blessed Mother look like? She looked beautiful. Her beauty is, uh, give us a lot of confidence the soon we see her. And did she wear the same sort of clothes that we are normally accustomed to? Seeing? She had a um, white uh, dress and a um, blue cape, but uh, the dress is long. Yes. What was the reaction of your parents at the time when you first started to talk about the apparitions? The first day, uh, they don't believe, but at the CS and Estasis, they believe. And am I right in understanding, Conchita, that wherever the four of you were in Garabandal, in separate houses or out playing separately and so on, you got the call at the same time? Yes. We had some kind of feelings in some called llamadas. That, uh, we are in different places, we had the calls at the same time. And what was that feeling that you got? It's, uh, we never can explain the feelings, but... Uh, the feeling is making us go to the place where the Blessed Mother wanted to see us, or she wanted to see her. See her. And that was a place called the Pines, is that right? In different places. The first time we see her is the place is called La Calleja. It's sometimes in the Pines, in different places, in the front of the Chateau. And how many apparitions were there all together during the, the two, two or three years? I don't remember, but a lot of times. A lot of times? Yes. Yes. Now, um, what did you talk about to her? We talk about the first time we talk about a lot of things, but when we see her, it gives us a lot of confidence. It, um, the people give us messages, we give it to her. It, we say the rosary with her too. And was there an angel with her at the beginning or, or every time or, or the what? The first time we had the apparition is one angel. And the first time we see her, the angel coming with her, then she coming all along. Hmm. Now, um, the last apparition, she gave you a message, a full message. Yes. Yes, and she gave you this in Spanish. Yes. Would you say the, the message for me in Spanish? Yes, I had a writing here in English. So do you want to write in English? But I think it's the more important thing and the, all the apparitions and Gravanda. Do you like to read in English? I, I, would, I would like to hear it in Spanish first. Yes. Yes. I want to read in Spanish, but making me so nervous to talk in the camera. <laughs> yeah. Um, uh, the message, uh, the angel give it to us, but the Blessed Mother tell him, give it to us. Eh, como no se ha cumplido y no se ha hecho conocer al mundo mi mensaje del 18 de octubre, os diré que este es el último. Antes la copa se estaba llenando, ahora está rebosando. Los sacerdotes, obispos y cardenales van muchos por el camino de la perdición y con ellos llevan a muchas más almas. A la Eucaristía cada vez se le da menos importancia. Debéis evitar la ira de Dios sobre vosotros con vuestros esfuerzos. Si le pedís perdón con vuestras almas sinceras, Él os perdonará. Yo, vuestra madre, por intercesión del ángel San Miguel, os quiero decir que os enmendéis. Ya estáis en los últimos avisos. Os quiero mucho y no quiero vuestra condenación. Pedidnos sinceramente y nosotros lo daremos. Debéis sacrificaros más, pensad en la pasión de Jesús. This is the last message the Blessed Mother gave it to us. Yes. Now, the, the, the meaning of that, broadly speaking, in, in shortened form, the, that message is what in English? 
that uh, she said uh, the sacrifice, the penance. She said uh, with uh, the more and more uh, we don't have no respect to the Holy Eucharist. And then uh, he said, uh, pray for the priest, bishop, the cardinal, but they go to the wrong way and they bring a lot of salt with them. And they say to uh, think a lot in the passion of Jesus. And um, ask to Jesus forgiveness with sincere heart, but he, he wanted to forgive us. No. All right. I like to say better hair walls, but you know. That's all right. Now, now, what, what, what will the miracle eventually be? The blessed mother say one miracle gonna happen, but only I can say eight days before. You, you will say what eight days before? The day of the miracle. You will actually nominate the day. Yes. Now, is it true that it will be in April or May? I say gonna happen between. Uh, April and June, but, uh, between the months. Yes, and and you will announce that eight days. Eight days before. before. Why cannot you tell us now? But you say say eight days before. I don't know why. That is what the Blessed Mother said. Yes. Yes. Did did the other three girls get this message as well? No, they don't know about the miracle. They don't know about the day of the miracle. No, but, but you do. <coughs> yes, I do. Is it soon? Yes. It is soon? Yes. Is it, is it years or months? I can say only eight days yeah. before. You, you, yes. And, and presumably you have been guided uh, in this by your local clergy and, and bishops and so on. Excuse me? It's, it's, no, it's all right. It's all right. Sorry. Um, what? Will there be a warning before you give the message or, or is the warning at about the same time? No, the Blessed Mother say before the miracle is one, is one warning is coming to the whole world. Is something going to happen in the whole world? In, uh, they go know, everybody going to know it's coming from God. Yes, no matter where we are. Yes, yeah. it don't have nothing to do with Caravandal, but it's something going to happen, like prepare ourselves to the, the miracle, yes. to see the miracle. Yes. Can I just take time out now? I mentioned a film uh, in my introduction to Conchita, and this is what is extraordinary, that there is a good, I know there's a good four hours of film somewhere um, in the uh, possession of people who are interested in Garabandal, the association song. Um, let us just remind you of, of the sort of thing that happened in Garabandal. You can roll it there, Colette, please. And this is a, is a picture of the girls actually in an ecstatic trance during an apparition. Motion pictures that show the girls doing these ecstatic walks. First we see Conchita. She is the only girl in ecstasy. Notice how far back her head is. Finally her walk ends at the church door. Here we see two of the girls walking arm in arm to the church. First we see them walking backward. And now, slowly, they turn and walk forward. On one occasion, it was noted that while four of the girls were walking arm in arm, they crossed a plank over a ditch in front of the church. This bridge was only wide enough for one girl. The others walked on air. A diocesan band soon forbade the children to enter the church during their ecstasies. From that time on, the Blessed Virgin only led the girls around the church or up to the church door. But as an example of obedience, she never took them inside. Our Blessed Mother told these children that it is very important that we always obey the church. For obedience to the church gives great honor and glory to God. Do you recall, Conchita, at any stage, what your feelings were during that trance? What is the feelings I feel? Uh, when I see her, the, the, it's like a chitake us from the air. You know, chitake us from here. It, we feel so happy to see her. Well, like we don't ever want to see her, you know, leave her. Yeah. It's beautiful feelings, but it's very hard to explain the feelings to yeah. be with her. Um, your feelings about the world now, Conchita, do you, do you find the world a depressing place to be, or, or what? I feel like it's a place to, 
to be pre- the world to me is the place to prepare ourselves to go to heaven. And how do you do that? I try to do what I can sometimes. You know, listen to uh, the pulpit, do what the blessed mother message. And, and are your family religious? Your own, your own daughters and son? Yeah, I think they are very religious. Yeah, they like to go to church, say the rosary. Mm-hmm. Do your neighbors know who you are? No, the nobody knows. Nobody? Nobody. My pastor don't know, and nobody in my church. And, and why, why do you not want more publicity for the cause of Garabandal? But for the cause of Garabandal, I don't, you know, I, I love to everybody know about the messes, but I don't want anybody to know it's me. I don't know why. Maybe for my children, they go to school. I don't want to. Do the children know? No. Today they asked me why you gonna be on TV. I say I don't know. <laughs> you you said you don't know. Yeah. Oh, and where are they? Yeah, now? they are outside. They are here with you. Yes. The, the, the three older ones are here. Yes. With you. Yes. And they and well they know after this surely. I don't know. I tell them pray for me. <laughs> <laughs> and, and, and if they, if they don't know that, that you are one of the ones who was involved in Garabandal, yes. but they do know about Garabandal, they have heard about it, surely. I don't know. But in my house, we never talk about Garabandal. I had a holy hour in my house. It, uh, we never talk about Garabandal there. And around me, never, we never talk about that. For this hour, maybe they never hear it. And the other three girls uh, are in America. Do you, do you make any contact with the other three girls? I talked to one, Jacinta, in California. Mm. But we never talk about Garabanda living. Yes, it's extraordinary that, that you're trying to... <coughs> you're not trying to forget about it, but you are trying to, to leave it to one side in your life. This happened now. Uh, before, without, with, after the apparitions finished, to me, I think it's nothing is true. And then after that, a uh, library don't talk about. It's, it's a big difference between the without before. Before without, we love to talk about the apparitions. Yes. Now it's hard to do it. Yes. Now, you, you also speak uh, about the chastisement. Do you understand that word? Yes. Yes. When is that due to happen? The Blessed Mother say if we don't change, uh, the chastisement is coming, but there's no sure it's coming. I'm sorry, I didn't, I didn't get the last bit. The Blessed Mother say, uh, hey, we don't change. Hey, if we, we don't change, yes. yes. Then sing us the, then God can sing us the chastisement. Yes, a, but, pu- a punishment will yeah, come. Yeah, punishment. Yes. But uh, we change, uh, you know, she don't sing to us. Yes, yes. All right, well now, thank you very much indeed sure, for joining welcome. us. It's lovely to meet you. I've, I've read a great deal about uh, Garaband Dal and about yourself, and it's very good of you to make an exception and come and talk to us. All right? Thank you. Conchita, ladies and gentlemen. Here you are, then. Thank you indeed. That was Conchita Gonzalez, and uh, I've no doubt that at home you'll be hearing a great deal more about uh, Garabandal as time goes on. We'll take another break now, John.